me, you're probably wondering how I ended up in this situation. Good morning, guys. It is half 11 here in Jamaica, officially day two. Currently on the second leg of the hike this morning. Went all the way down to the bottom of the hill um, and then all the way back up and it took about maybe just over an hour with hardly any stops just a bit of water so not too bad and i've just done a walk up on the second leg to see if we can try and see um rita marley's house which is found so all good um so yeah i don't know how this vlog is going to go really and truly i think i will share my outfits per day with you guys um and then yeah, just give you a little tour of the few sites um, that are around. So let's start with today's outfit. So I've got this bucket hat that I picked up from Primark. Just ran and grabbed it. This, of course, we've got Bob Marley t-shirt going, um, which I actually picked up. Oh no, actually, forgive me. My parents gave this to me the last time they were here. Then we've just got some um, Under Armour leggings on and my trusty New Balances and some gym shark socks. Yeah, all prepped and ready for the hike. So just gonna go back in now, do some admin bits, um, try and sort out what I wanna do for the rest of the week. And yeah, that's it. So I shall see you guys later. Hi guys, welcome to the new travel vlog. We are in Jamaica. I'm so excited. Right, listen. So I've been here for five days already. I wasn't sure if I was gonna vlog. Um, ooh, mosquito. I wasn't sure if I was gonna vlog this trip, um, but I thought kind of like two, three days in, it would probably be a good idea for you guys to just or for me to share some bits and pieces with you guys, places I go to. If I do any excursions or go to any restaurants and bars and things like that, perhaps you're thinking of going to Jamaica yourself at some point this year or in the future. So I thought it'd be good to share with you guys. I haven't done a huge deal, but I have already done quite a bit. So um, I've already done a hike up and down Jack's Hill, which took about an hour. We're going on hike two. We'll probably do the same hike so we can try and beat our target or we'll change course and do something different. Um, and I've already been to a number of different restaurants and spent New Year's here, which was fantastic. Um, so yeah, hopefully I have some footage of that that I can share with you guys. Uh, but otherwise, yes, we are in Jamaica. Very unexpected trip, um, but a fantastic way to start or end 2023 and start 2024. Um, so yeah, just looking forward to everything that there is to come. So first and foremost, Happy New Year to you all. I hope you guys all had a fantastic um, 
new year and um yeah let's get on to share more of jamaica with you doing Jack's Hill again for the second time trying to beat the first target of one hour see how it goes but keeping up the momentum secretly dying but we're gonna keep going till we get to the top of the hill okay guys so I'm back in from the second hike I'm absolutely shattered and sweaty oh my gosh very good. Look at me. <laughs> this isn't a glow. This is sweat. Oh. I need a shower and then I'm probably going to do some reading and journaling out here. Um, oh my gosh, let me show you my journal that I picked up for the new year. Some of you have probably already heard of this, but I feel like this is a really good one. Five minute journal. It's great. It's got a little section in the front about how it works and then it's got bits in here um that show you kind of like how to take accountability what your plans are um any habits and things like that i think um and then it's also got like weekly challenges in it and then like different affirmations and statements and sections that you can write what you're grateful for um and any highlights of your day what you learned during the day so i think that's really good and then the other book that i brought with me is one that i got for christmas which is the four agreements apparently this is a really really good book um so i'm looking forward to read that if you guys have any book recommendations, then let me know. Because this year, one of my goals is to... I, I haven't done enough reading, um, as I'd like to do. So one of my goals this year is to read one book a month, at least. Because I feel like that is achievable. Um, with a slight challenge with everything that you end up having. Look at how sweaty I am. Oh my God. That walk was no joke. No joke at all. Okay, guys, I'm going to clean the apartment and then get showered and everything. And then I think we might go into Kingston, New Kingston later today. I actually stopped off and had a patty on this walk. So I think when we go into Kingston, I'll get another one. So yeah. show you guys that. This is the outfit of the day. I don't know if you saw it earlier, but I've got this Charles Keith bag on, Arquette linen shirt, um, just a simple tank, and then I've got an old Zara um, satin skirt. And then my Birkenstocks, very, very easy. And my number one favorite Amazon um, dupes, well, um, what was I saying? My Amazon not Amazon dupes, my Bottega dupes. Dupe earrings that I got from Amazon, which I absolutely love. Right, let's find some painkillers. I have a headache at the moment. Snacks, snacks, snacks.
um, and we're really, really hot. So we are travelling down to New Kingston to catch a coach to the grill. We're going to stay in the grill for the next two and a half days. Um, and the journey to the grill is about five hours. So I've got books, I've got snacks. Oh, I'm going to show you the snacks that we picked up last night. Um, as well as like drinks. And I also picked up the Jamaican version of Una which I think is fantastic. So we'll be playing that. Um, and then, yeah, a five hour journey. We're gonna to need to keep ourselves occupied. Um, this is a long trip, but it should be worth it. Um, and I will show you where we stay when we get there. So yeah, see you in five hours. Currently on the coach at the first stop. Thank <laughs> you. 